I don't like that Elijah has more stamina than us. Well, he's... That makes me feel aged. 17. I know. They say you hit your we are... Like well, let's not real. say how old we are. You're, you're 40. We're both 40, but he's like, oh, you guys are a lot more tired than I am. <laughs> I'm like, well, you've got a lot more sleep than us, buddy. Well, it's no, not my are, age. Okay. <laughs> Okay, good morning. We're it was a horrible but amazing day. <laughs> yeah, yesterday was, was a day. Um but we're actually out of the out of the field now. We've been I don't know if you can see out there, but we're now up in the regular part of the RV park or the camping ground because someone came. We got pulled out of that grass, so hurt my pride a little bit and also made me feel a little stupid that we got stuck down there. Um, anyways, we're out of there. We're plugged in so we can kind of take care of some business here in the trailer. And then uh, we'll get going again. But Megan's making breakfast for us. Scrambled eggs and... Is that prosciutto? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Alright. Let's be in Europe. So I'm looking forward to a day where... Hopefully we have fewer things go wrong, but um, we'll see some fun stuff today, so. We're leaving our beautiful and epically stressful campground. It was also epically beautiful and fun. Every time we look out the window, it's like, oh my gosh, these windows are terrible, so I can't show you very well. But it was beautiful. And now we're gonna head to a grocery store and get a couple more things and then to an amazing day full of amazing adventures. Mike and Elijah are up there together. I'm in the, I'm in the mush pot back here. What's this one called? Skogafoss? Skogafoss. It's incredible, you guys. I'm really sad because I don't, I think the only way you could really understand the epic magnitude of the beauty here is with a drone, and we can do that. But I get to see it, and all I'm saying is we only bought these tickets last month. You could be here in Iceland next month or the month after and see the green, beautiful, ridiculous summer in Iceland. So, it's amazing. And like, when we first got here, I'm like, why would you wanna live in Iceland? It's so cold and dark. And it's like, because people have their dang little farmhouses at the base of these, and it just keeps going and going and going, just covered in waterfalls. Ridiculous. So, now we're gonna go to Skogafoss and get our minds blown again. And over and over and over Any again. of our Icelandic viewers, we understand we're saying everything wrong, but we apologize. Woo! All right, Mike, where Sit. are we? Skogafas. Beautiful. Unconveyable. I get the feeling this won't be our last 
trip to Iceland. No. It's, it's amazing. And I think we're just going to scratch the surface. So, yeah. Iceland. over there in orange. We saw the waterfall from that vantage point. Now we're going to go up There's some steps right up there, right there, up to the top. We're going to check that out. few steps. the Garden of Eden. <laughs> it is incredible. So right now we're actually above the waterfall that we first saw. We hiked up all those stairs and then there's a trail that goes up here. And you can see people probably back there hiking along. So we're just following this trail. We're not sure exactly how far it goes, but I figure we explore it and the, the river is beautiful up here. Waterfall, grabbing lunch. We are in the parking lot. It's our view of the waterfall. Can you see it through the screen? Kind of. And then on to the next that range place. Is in the way. about half hour down the road. Can you believe, Elijah, what a difference today is from yesterday? Like, yesterday was awesome, but it had a dark sort of like feel to it as well. <laughs> yes. That also probably everything that went we wrong. were so tired. And we were also super tired. Today is beautiful for one thing. It's not, yesterday was super windy too, remember? Yeah, right, it's not windy at all. It's nice and calm today. Well, there's still like a nice breeze though. Yeah, it's, good. It's, it's very pleasant. We just keep pinching ourselves. We can't believe we're here. I don't, I wish we were here for a month. I know. Um, Maybe we should come live in Iceland for like a month next summer. The summer? Yeah. That'd be yeah. awesome. Now we're headed down, we're now we're at the beach, or the coast here. Again, only about a half hour from the waterfall we were just oh, last at. Everything is close. I mean this, I should, it's not real close, but 
you get a variety way at the other end of, that of beauty yeah, here off that cliff with not having yeah, to travel too far off the beaten path i'm sure the inner iceland's beautiful too but man nice water it's awesome black. sorry we're we're just looking around and amazed at all we're seeing okay no, just imagine how built in Okay, we're just like going crazy. This is cool. Taking pictures of this beautiful, beautiful place. Oh, you can see the arch from here. Better vantage point. Beautiful. Pretty beautiful. It is beautiful. Well, we're just itching to get down to those beaches. Well, I think, yeah, you can't actually see much more here. Black sand beaches and a church very, that very, very Vicky here. Very, <laughs> a church that everybody's seen, and we'll take photos of it. But right now we're gonna go get some dinner, and uh, yeah, wait for the sun to go down a little bit more so that the lighting's even prettier. But I mean, come on, Vic, you're oh, a look pretty at those. town. Those cliffs. Okay, we're going to our first black sand beach. You know, in Iceland, it's so ugly here. Oh my gosh. It's black sand. <laughs> Crazy. Black sand. It's like ash. Problem is, it'll take like three hours for the sun to come. Crazy. It's beautiful over there. Looky there. Wave just got Megan. You got water in your boot? Oh, I'm sorry. You'll be okay. Yeah, I got clean socks in there. It'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> and I and Mike but Lige and I were talking about how we can't get over how beautiful it is and yet how frustrating it is that you can't really capture the immensity and the beauty I mean there's yellow flowers all over and then these beautiful fragrant fragrant purple flowers and then the crazy rock formations and the birds it's like inconceivable 
no, it's 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 beautiful. It is if epic or ever appropriate, it is here in Iceland. And over there, across the valley, is that beautiful church. Yeah. You can't see it. We'll show you later. Dinner time. Because it's still um, Sudervik. Oh, look at you. So it is uh, local time. 11.04. Or I thought it was 10.40. Oh, right, 10 that's your, I'm, oh. I'm looking when we're getting there. It, local time, it's 10.40 at night. That's 6.40 at night, our time. But you can see it's not dark. No. Because this is the Icelandic summer. Is today the summer solstice? It's 20th of June. Is no, it's it? tomorrow. Tomorrow is the summer solstice, longest day of the year. And so there is no dark here. And so, with that, we're going to go start a hike here. A four kilometer hike each way. Each way. Woo! We've already gone like almost 15,000 steps today, so. I've gone 15,000 steps. Okay, yeah. So um, that's gonna be interesting. But one of the things that I suggest to Elijah is he's, you know, he's about to leave home. And while he was homeschooled, it's still his senior year. And so yeah, I still wanted to get senior pictures. And I decided to hire this really really amazing photographer named me. No, I'm just kidding. I was a photographer for a long time and I did senior pictures for lots of other people. And this is the first chance for me to do it for my, my own senior right here. So I thought, wouldn't it be cool though? Let's not do them here in our, our dusty old town. Let's do them in Iceland. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna hike out to an old World War II plane that's in ruins on the beach and do some senior pictures there. And then, um, I think, is that all we're doing tonight? I think so. That's the only location we're doing tonight. I don't know what we're doing tomorrow. I'm just letting this guy and this guy tell me what I'm doing. But it's beautiful. Okay, so we're here, we just parked. You can see this is about as dark as it's gonna get here. Um, so we've got about a two mile hike out to the beach and to the plane. And we're hoping that the people that did go to it are on their way back so we can have it all to ourselves here at like midnight. We feel right now like we've been walking for miles on another planet. But well, we kind of have, the moon, because it's two miles out. But yeah, it does it's just, feel... it looks exactly, it's like stark. It looks exactly it the looks same. Like out of you know? Yeah. Such a, there's such a varied like landscape here. Yeah, because it was so You have really lush, and, and lush. then you have rocky and nothing. I like it though. Yeah, Elijah's all jazzed up. Okay, we're here at midnight. So that we could have the plane all to our. Uh, <laughs> okay, it's pretty cool. <laughs> okay, we're done at the plane. I don't think it's that interesting to actually film the plane, but there it is. It's pretty cool. Elijah actually did, Megan did some senior pictures for Elijah while we were out there. So he's gonna have some epic senior pictures, right, Elijah? Round one, round Sweet one, right? Epic. We should we should put a few right here to show, you know, like some like ching ching ching, and they come out. Let's yeah. do that right now. Okay. Okay, we gotta walk it's back like now, though. In the 40s now, it's, it's got it very got a lot cold, colder. So. We weren't really prepared. I don't have any gloves. The sun is. It's still light out, but what time is it? the sun is doing something for Iceland during the, the day. The sun does it's help. Cold. It's almost one in the morning right now. Yeah. And this is the brightness level. So I think this is pretty much like how it it's stays. brighter in, than it was before. This is how it stays, I think, until the sun starts to come up in about an hour, which is kind of crazy. <clears throat> in fact, it's going to take us an hour to get back to the car. What time is it? Oh, my goodness. All right, we better get back to the car. We might actually leave. We're still working on getting out of here. Waiting oh, for Elijah to, to pack up his stuff. We should have this in the background. It's just more interesting. Here we go. Now the shot's interesting. 
Ooh. This. I don't like that Elijah has more stamina than us. Well, he's. That makes me feel aged. 17. I know. They say you hit your we are. Like well, let's not real. say how old we are. You're, you're 40. We're both 40, but he's like, oh, you guys are a lot more tired than I am. <laughs> I'm like, well, you've got a lot more sleep than us, buddy. Well, it's no, not my age. <laughs> okay, we've been walking along on our way back to the car. It's 1 30 in the morning right now. And the sun's coming up. Sun, it's actually starting to get brighter. Yeah. But we turned around, saw this. I don't know if you can actually. I'm not sure if you can, you can't even see that out there. Hey, we can take a video of it real quick. That's the moon. It's big and orange. Pink. Or pink. Coral colored. It's really pretty out there. Oh, I'm getting tired though. I'm so tired. It's is, cold. Yeah, it's, but the cars are over there. I can see someone's headlights. So we're getting closer. Where Elijah's gonna take a shot of this moon, I guess. All right. It is, you see this? It can't really. 1.49 in the morning. Oh, let me see the steps. Yep, yeah, it was about 5,000 steps back. Megan is hungry. Megan wants to boil some water and uh, make, we have these instant noodles. So this is like college all over again, except in an RV in Iceland. Same dish. Look, it's gonna warm us up. It's gonna be yummy. I'm so cold. I will not get warm unless I do this. <laughs> Megan doesn't usually stay up this late, uh, and neither do I. Can't, I. I can't make real words. Well, it's, it's only, only 9.30 our time, or 10. 10 I know, time. but we got up at a normal time this morning for here, so yeah, we got up you've been up for early. a long time. Yeah. I mean, you don't look like you're tired anymore. <laughs> <laughs> this smells really good. I don't, Icelandic is, Asian is, soups. Look at is, all that good this stuff. This is 2 o'clock in the morning, Megan, talking right now. <laughs> so, <laughs> your standards have gone down. We ate our soup. Oh, you can't even really see on the I think camera. We're actually, we gotta see this. Darn it. We hold it up higher. Look at this. You see that? Y'all see that? That is the sun working on coming up. It is 2.23 in the morning. <clears throat> we are very tired. I think this is officially the latest we've stayed up to finish the video, right? Oh, you're right. Thanks for watching. I'm like the breeze. Like, comment, subscribe. Over here. And uh, go to northbandsouth.com and come back tomorrow for, for some more. Epic day in Iceland. Right, what she said. See ya. Bye. Bye. Okay. We said the day was over, but we're driving back to Vic and we're seeing the sun rise on the longest day of the year. And it's incredible. That's so beautiful. Okay. It's too beautiful. We decided that uh, we are not going back. We can't go to yet. bed yet because the sun is rising and no sleep till Iceland Brooklyn. looks prettier than ever. Yes. I mean, come on, look at that church up there. It's perfect. Cannot wait to shoot that. We're just frantically trying to capture the beauty of this place. It's hard. It's actually really hard to capture.